What is going on guys, Doug Sensen Martin here. Hope you guys are having a great day and right now, it's 10.33 in the morning. I was finally able to get eight hours of sleep. I am feeling so much better. Yesterday's vlog is going up, my first time playing Black Ops 3. The game is so much fun. I got 10 minutes to eat breakfast. I'm gonna go downstairs, I'm gonna get something to eat really quick, then we gotta go take headshots, then we gotta go play Black Ops 3 for a few hours, and then the live stream is finally gonna start. Today is like the big day. Today is the really important day. This is like the meat day while we're here. This is the most important time for us to be here because they're gonna be live streaming Black Ops 3 on Twitch TV to the entire world to see. So it's gonna be really exciting. I'm gonna take you guys along to the day with me. I'm gonna try to record as much as possible today because yesterday I didn't record as much because I didn't know like what I was able to record, but I'm gonna see what I can do today. I'm gonna get some breakfast and I'll see you guys soon. All right guys, so breakfast closes at 10.30 and it's 10.39 and luckily I was able to get a bowl of frosted flakes and a glass of orange juice before they closed. And guys, look at this view from the Hyatt Hotel in Germany. That's a really, really nice view. All right, so we're on our way to the venue. I can't believe how bad it smells right now. It's literally worse than poop. Like, take poop and times it by 10 and that's what it smells like. But I'm here with the whole crew. About to play some Black Ops 3 again today. Today's a big day. We're going to be on the live stream on Twitch TV. I'm not sure exactly what the link is, but uh, I'm going to be tweeting it out on my Twitter account. And I'm actually really happy that the event isn't open to the public yet. And we're going to be out of here before it's going to get really crazy. If you guys know anything about Gamescom, it's basically the biggest event for any video game throughout the year. They have like 300,000 or 400,000 people here. And we're lucky because we're only here during the weekday, so there's not gonna be as many people, and the room that we're playing Black Ops 3 in is gonna be closed off to the public, so we don't have to deal with being crammed in with a bunch of people, being crowded around a lot of people watching us play the game. It's only gonna be open to the, the press and anyone else that they invite into the, the venue to play. So we're about to head in there right now. We're gonna play for a little bit, then we gotta go take headshots, and then the live stream's gonna happen. So guys, this is exactly what I was talking about. This is not even crowded. This is like the media day where people who are only invited to get it in. I think that's true. I'm not 100% sure, but it's not that crowded right now and if we were to be here on Friday, Saturday, Sunday, you would not be able to move. It would be extremely hot. It would just be disgusting. It would be uncomfortable. So I am so, so happy that we're able to be here during the week playing the game and then we get to get out of here before the weekend. So we're outside here at Gamescom. These are all the booths. We're trying to get some food in that booth behind Teep. Sorry. And it turns out that they're trying to like reset all the plates and everything. And we had to wait too long. And we had to go get our headshots now. So we're going to go back to the Activision Black Ops 3 booth. I'm going to show you guys a little bit of the booth. I can't show you any of the screens because it's against. I'm not allowed to do it. So I can't show you guys the screens. But we're about to go ahead to the ESL booth after we go to the Activision booth. Take some headshots. We're hungry. We're starving. We want to get some food. And then we're going to play some Black Ops 3 on the live stream. I think you guys are really going to enjoy it. The three maps and we played are a lot of fun to play and I can't wait to show you guys. Right now we're about to go head out for some food. We got some cabs for us ready and we're gonna go get our headshots at the ESL headquarters. We got to the ESL studios and here with the whole gang, the crew. We got our still water and some pretzels. Got some pretzels. That's what I was just gonna say guys, I'm so hungry right now and these pretzels are the only thing that's keeping me alive. It didn't really work. You dropped your pretzels I don't think it's uh, very good to go to the store. It's so good. Therefore, I was able to find a very good fight uh, position. I need some more. Aggressive since I made turrets. If I make turrets against. State your name for the camera. What? State your name for the camera. Ivan. Ivan does not know what these are. <laughs> Here. It's a pretzel. Eat it. It's delicious. Only one. Yes. Do you like it? <laughs> I'm just no. <laughs> uh, okay. I respect it. All right, guys. We're in the back room right now with all the players. We got Kotaga, Buzzo, Merc, Tommy, Flux. Flex. Okay, I'm sorry about that. And we're waiting right now. We're doing a couple of rehearsals. We got Von, the man himself, over here. Show it up for the vlog. Hello. <laughs> and uh, this is the stage that we're going to be going out on. It's going to be a really, really important day for Call of Duty Esports for Black Ops 3. I think you guys are going to be really excited. You guys watched this yesterday. You guys are going to be really excited for Black Ops 3. We only 
played three maps in modes, but trust me guys, like this game is gonna be the real deal. And I, I know that I say that about a lot of stuff, but this is one of the things that I really mean it for. So right now, we're all just chilling around. We're doing like literally absolutely nothing. Just standing here and waiting until we can get on stage and do a couple more rehearsals before we actually do the live stream. It's only a one hour live stream. We gotta make it perfect. All right guys, so we just finished up the show match. I think you guys really enjoyed it. I got a lot of positive feedback on Twitter. I think everyone really enjoyed the reveal of Black Ops 3. As you guys can tell, this is the stage that we played on. I was sitting in that third chair from the left, second chair from the left, over there, and this is my team. I had Buzzo, myself, Gotaga, and then Kiwi, and then the other team was obviously Merc, TP, Flex, and uh, Tommy. So we beat them in the, the two out of three. We beat them in the last map uplink. It was so much fun. I cannot wait to play this game competitively, but we're about to head out of here right now. And by the way, I'm going to give away this t-shirt. Uh, I'm going to autograph it as well if you guys want it. All you have to do is retweet my tweet on Twitter. I retweeted it the other day. I just retweeted it. I'll pick a winner when I get back home. We're about to go head back to the hotel. I think we're going to get some food. Yo, you hungry right now, dude? Yeah, I'm hungry too. Off, like, right win. Yo, that was an awesome win. We were taking that seriously, man. We were, we were going hard. Dude, I was getting hated off that first map. Like, we got destroyed. <laughs> I don't know about you, dog. How'd you go? I, I did bad. Gotaga and I, Gotaga and I dropped like negative 10. And I was like, oh god, everyone's watching right now. I know it's just a show match, but everyone's watching. So it's the first impression to get a Black Ops 3. We got to step it up, and that's what we did, and we won. So it was a lot of fun. Just want to say again, thank you to Activision. And PlayStation 4 is what the system's going to be on. They finally announced that. I wasn't allowed to say anything about that, but I'm I'm so happy that Black Ops 3 is on PlayStation 4. You guys have no idea how happy I am about that. So we're about to go head back to the hotel, grab some food, and we're gonna celebrate tonight because today was an awesome day. So having a post-dinner celebration for the really great turn of events that we had at the uh, Activision Black Ops 3 reveal. We're out here in Germany. I don't know exactly where we are. Tyler, did you, you, you've you never been here, obviously, right? No, I've never. First time. Yo, Joe, you've never seen this place before, right? This is where we're going, guys. We're going to Etrusa Restaurante, an Italian restaurant with all the uh, the buddies and guys. I sound so awkward right now. What's up, man? I just said buddies and guys. I'm so awkward. <laughs> but we're out here with the Activision dudes, Mr. X, Maven, and a bunch of other guys. We're going to be hanging out and having a great dinner tonight. So, guys, we're out here at this Italian restaurant in Germany. We got the whole crew with us all the way down to the end. We had an extra room on the table because of so many people. Everyone from Activision, Treyarch, Mr. Joey D. Merck. And what we're going to be doing right now is trying my first piece of salmon. Now, I've never eaten salmon before. Never had any interest in eating salmon. Buzzo is freaking out. He doesn't believe it right now. Where does it have to be? Buzzo, what's the other videos? First time. First time trying salmon. My first salmon. First salmon. My first salmon. salmon. Yeah, so Buzzo offered Joe a piece of salmon, and he was like, sure. I gave Joe a piece of my steak, which is actually really good. And Joe's going to eat some of the salmon. What do you think of it, Joe? It's good? All right, guys, we're just going to give this a go. We're going to try this, and uh, it's, yeah. My you want me to hold it? Yeah, yeah, go ahead, Robert. <laughs> You're going to love the first piece of salmon. Doug, you deep throat that salmon. All right. Bigger, bigger, bigger. Is this good? Bigger. Oh, bigger. Like piece, right? Bigger. Yep. Oh, my chicken of the ocean. <clears throat> it's good to bust. My first piece of salmon, guys. Drink some wine. Drink some wine. I'm getting my stomach dropping. <laughs> it's good. I freak myself out. But it's not bad, right? It's got a very... It's, oh, there's a little bit of a freak myself out. It's a mental thing. Yeah. You love fish. Tell me I love it. Drink some wine. Tell me I love it. Love it. Drink some wine. Drink some wine. That's not wine. That's the opposite of wine. That's coke. That was my first time ever eating fish. Ever. It was weird. I, I do this thing with myself. When I eat something new, I automatically want to say it's bad in my head. So when it's, when it's my taste buds are eating the food, my head's just saying it's bad. It's bad. It's bad. Throw it out. Throw it up. Throw it up. Throw it up. So like hearing Maven say, eat it. Eat it. Eat it. It helps me. Time ever. Really? Your first 
first time ever eating bread? My first time ever eating bread. Do you have, do you have some bread right there? Is this? Oh, with tomato sauce. Never had tomato sauce. It looks like somebody chewed that though. Yeah, he did. It's oh, it's, you you ate his first first time. Ever. So now it's on your plate. That's I'm, so disrespectful of you. Why would you eat some of it and drop it on his plate? I've never had tomato sauce, so first time. Okay. I've never had Buzzo's jerk. First time, and I've never had bread. Let's do this. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I can't hold the camera straight, I'm laughing too hard. <laughs> what it? happens when you eat bread? It just tastes awful. I can really distinct like Buzzer's germs. It might have looked bad. It wasn't a good choice. Alright, so guys, that was my first. I swear on my life, every single one of my food videos are real. I don't know how else I could show you by telling you. But this was my first piece of salmon. It actually did taste good, but whenever I try something new, my brain tells me no. Don't eat it, Doug. It's bad for you. It's going to make you sick. You're going to throw it up. It's some. I have like a condition. I really do have a condition, but we're going to finish up our dinner here. Today was a fantastic day. We had a great day at the Black Ops 3 Esports Reveal. We had a lot of fun, and we're just trying to enjoy ourselves because we're going to have one more day left here in Germany, guys. All right, so guys, we're finally back in the hotel room. Today was an absolute success. It was so much fun. We did all this rehearsing. Like, yesterday, we all we did was just play Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Today, all we did was just rehearse, 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 and it gets tedious over time, but it was so worth it. When we actually played, I had a blast. It was the most fun I've had in a long time playing, and like I said, guys, I haven't been to a Call of Duty LAN event since. Um, Call of Duty Champs, and I don't know if you guys can tell, you guys will probably see it. Someone's probably going to point it out eventually. Oh, you guys can't even see it. I'm just in my boxes right now, and you can't even see that in the mirror. I thought someone was going to be able to point it out, but um, this is my first LAN event I've played in since Call of Duty Champs, so I had so much fun. It was so much fun. It was like the best. It was. There's nine Call of Duty games, and I think this is the best Call of Duty in. Maybe I'm naive. Maybe I haven't had enough, you know, time playing the game to say that, but it just feels so good. So we had an absolute blast playing in the stream. It was entertaining. I made a couple of really cool plays that I was able to put up on my YouTube channel. We'll be putting an SD gameplay up later today on my channel. And also when the beta comes out, I'm gonna be grinding that, getting as many gameplays as possible. So if you guys want to see like a Call of Duty cut com, or if you want to see a straight through gameplay or like a live com, let me know in the comments down below. I want a live com, I want a cut com. I want just a straight gameplay, no webcam, no talking, just gameplay. Just let me know what you guys want to see. And also, I'm going to be giving away this Black Ops 3 signed autograph t-shirt. If you guys want it, I'm going to put a link in the bottom of the description, like towards the middle of it. All you have to do is click the link and retweet my tweet. Follow me on my Twitter account, and that's it. I'm going to send it out to one random person who retweets it. So uh, that's what I'm going to wrap up this vlog for today. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. And if you did, guys, I would really appreciate it if you dropped a thumbs up on the video. Thank you guys so much for all the support on my YouTube channel. It means so much to me, guys. Really, it really does. Have a great night, guys. This has been your boy, Doug Sex and Martin, and I'm out, guys. Peace.